Hi guys, for anybody that doesn't know me, I'm Emma Ryder, psychic medium and angel channeler. It is the new moon in Sagittarius today and I've felt drawn to come on and do a video and update on energies. The um, energies have been quite tough going, really heavy energies just of this last, I want to say three weeks, could be a bit longer. Um, Probably since the last full moon, they've been really hard going for a lot of people. A lot of crap's been coming up to the surface for folk. Um, even stuff that, from one year to the next, they haven't really thought about. And it's been like hitting really hard. Stuff that we really thought we'd healed from. And the bits and pieces are coming to the surface. And all I can say to you is, hang in there just keep breathing try to go with the flow as much as possible because the energy is changing i almost feel like the energy axis today is shifting for so many people yes there'll still be stuff to deal with but there's a feeling of yes we've just come out of mercury retrograde as well which will help which the o2 catastrophe with everybody's not being able to communicate was really rather funny and well timed with that but the energy axis is a changing and it feels like the heavy energy is lifting and we're sort of changing to fast pace slightly manic energy yes that's brilliant but what i want to say to you is try not to get so um totally running at 100 mile an hour with this fast paced energy it you need to make sure you look after yourself and really take that time to just be although you've got loads more energy and you're wanting to get all loads of stuff done because you're really focused on the future that's really good but to keep the future coming and for you to get what you're wanting in the future it's really important to look after you and have that balance talking with my hands again I can't help it um and today tonight even you're still in new moon energy tomorrow in the next couple of days what I would say to you is really get clear on what you're wanting in your life both of the little things like what do you want to achieve this month what do you want to achieve in six months and then get and plan the bigger things as well but what I want to say to you is really get clear in detail because it's not only the massive goals you want you've got goals every week every month get into detail and let the new moon energy help you manifest that and set your clear intentions okay um because yes the universe is listening when you're having that tug of war in your head and heart and we like oh yeah i want that and then doubt pops in oh no but you're not having that because you can't do that um, what I would say to you is really get clear and um, it will help ramp up that energy and really go for what you're wanting, okay? But as well as life getting busier and lots of new stuff coming in, it's really important to look after you. That feels really significant this next few weeks, okay? And I just thought I'd shuffle a few cards and see what comes up for us as well for the new moon message the first card that fell out of the pack is see beyond the current situations with the seer card okay so that really is everybody's feeling a bit tired and shitty because of all the crap which she's been bringing up with this really heavy energy so know that is passing and clearer energy is coming you'll be able to move forward with more clarity okay and Mother Earth, feel loved and comforted. It's really important to give yourself that love and look after you and your energy because that will mean things happen much more easily for you because when you get exhausted and you sort of hit a brick wall physically, energy-wise, stuff stops happening and you're just too tired to focus and um, think about what you want, let alone let it happen. You almost shut down energetically for a little bit while you go into your little hibernation to rest 
so if you can keep going but having those little hibernation things times to keep your energy high it will help you so much okay um and i feel like i need to pick a card out of this this pack too so the <laughs> the nettle card and that's a really good card for setting boundaries and knowing that it's okay for them invisible boundaries don't let people take the mic really because there's been a lot of that and it's okay to stand up for yourself say no once in a while and keep that balance in your life because your life is as important as anybody else's so it's really important to look after you i hope you have a fabulous new moon um, really do take the time to manifest and get clear on where you're wanting and what you're wanting to achieve this next few weeks and going into the bigger things in the future and look out for my weekly guidance video on Sunday. Okay, take care folks. Bye!